Next, you need to add a new contest, which you can do here by clicking the Add Contest button um, or by editing the default contest. Um, when you install Contest Burner, there may be a default contest um, set up by, uh, by set up automatically, and you can edit that contest. Um, and if you don't have the premium version, you can only run one contest at a time. So if it does um, activate a default contest, you'll need to end it uh, before you can set up another one. So you can add a new contest. Number one, you give it the contest name. And I'm going to do that right now. So we're just going to say test contest. Now keep in mind on some of these uh, settings, the public pages, that your users are going to see, they will see some of these. For example, the contest name. So it's good to give it a a nice description. Maybe talk about how many pr your prizes in there. For winning a new car, and then you give it a nice description. You select what method you're going to use for awarding prizes. And right now, the plugin has two methods. One is just a race to the finish line, so whoever has the most points wins. The other is a random drawing, which are the ones that I like um, to run because it gives everybody a chance at winning. That way, you don't get two or three people who end up being far ahead of everybody else. Then it discourages all the rest of your contestants and they don't participate. With a random drawing, even people coming in late in the contest or people who um, you know, maybe are not as active as your leaders are still have a shot at winning. And basically how that works then is um, the more promotional steps people make, the more tickets they get into your drawing. So Contest Burner will actually handle the random drawing for you when you end your contest. You can just click a link and it will actually handle all the random selection of your prizes for you and then list all the winners on your results page all automatically. You also have a setting here you can restrict your contest so that only one person can win um, uh, you know you can only win one prize per person or you could let someone win multiple prizes so that if the random drawing selects their tickets twice they can still win two prizes. And then here's where you describe your contest prizes. So So we'd have a new car, we have one, we're only giving out one. You can change quantities too. So if you want to give out uh, multiple second, third, or fourth place prizes, you can do that. So we could give out 10 new cars if we wanted to. We just change that to 10. Then you click add another prize. Here's our second place prize. And we're making a new truck. And we're going to give out, uh, we'll give out eight new trucks. And you just keep doing this. So then you can add as many of the, as you want. Um, and we're going to give out a cat for the other prize, and we're going to give out we'll give out 27 cats. <laughs> I'm just being silly there, but um, so once you've added all your prizes, you click Add Contest, and that's going to set the contest up. Now you'll see here. Here's that contest I just set up. Um, you'll see up here, this contest right here is one I'm currently running. This is the uh, public launch contest that was uh, attached to the viral YouTube video that I put out. So this contest is currently running, and it shows all the stuff that I've got set up for it.